All right, here is the 1941 Lincoln Continental Cabriolet. One of 400 Cabriolets or convertibles made for that model year. Um, this car is powered by the 292 cubic inch flathead V12. V12. Uh, it's a three speed on the tree setup. Um, I placed the grills here. They're uh, just hanging in there just so you can kind of see what the visualize what the car looks like. Um, you can see it's in project condition. There are some areas of bodywork. Um, same exact side on the other side. Same exact thing on the other side. Um, got a box of parts here. Some miscellaneous um, window cranks, door pulls, armrests, some brackets, license plate bracket. A lot of this is for the uh, the, the rear bumper, which is uh, missing in action at the moment. Also in there are these lights. Uh, yeah. So, a little tear here in the convertible top. Again, that body work that I was mentioning. It's a little rusty here. This is my favorite part of the car. I think that is a really cool door opener, handle, not a handle, button. Uh, the door panels are missing on both sides. Um, the, the gauges are also missing on this car. Here you've got the bumper, some bumper caps, another uh, bumper piece here. Um, no carpet, but you can see the floors are really solid. Uh, that must be some type of vent hole um, or cut out to do some sort of service on this thing at some point. Another area of body work. The flathead V12, uh, it's a complete motor as you can see all the stuff on it. Um, there's some areas here showing you. Uh, the motor spins freely, but um, so this fan is actually tied to the crank. Um, you can see the pulley comes right out. So, um, but yeah, it's showing that it spins freely. Got some horns here, 